Okay. We are almost there. Actually, I'm literally going to take the bare minimum. Because I think... Reconfirming very quickly... That I need Wing Pikmin to carry him. I need to break this gate to Wing Pikmin over that. And then the exit is literally up here. So yeah, I'm literally just going to take Wing Pikmin. That's not... The right way to go again. Pick you up by your feet. <laughs> there you go. Everyone join appendages of some form. And sing a song. Sing the Pikmin song. Oh, so I did find out also from watching people play this that from having 20 of each Pikmin in your party, they actually do sing. They don't sing the Pikmin song. They sing uh, the main theme of Pikmin 3 instead. But they do sing something, so... But it is a little hard to hear. <clears throat> okay, so that's that for that then. Oh, hello. Alright, so Brittany is going to, one click at a time, travel through the oak. And we are going to continue finishing the path. Alright. We can do this. <laughs> the foam at the mouth is just for show. Okay. Actually, 20 wing pigment is going to make this take a very long time to break the gate down. Hindsight was a little poor in that regard, but oh well. I just don't want to overdo anything, so I don't have a large amount of Pikmin I need to worry about. But eh. It'll be okay. We'll be fine. Okay. And I mean, honestly, once I get Olimar all the way to the end anyway, I'm going to end up resetting the day. Anyway, so... It's really whatever. I'm just hoping... Actually, you know what? I'm going to play as Brittany now. And I'm going to make sure that there isn't anything dangerous. Because I think, once, since I've killed everything, that they're not going to come back. But I don't actually know. So, I mean, if I need to do some tricky maneuvering, then I can. But I shouldn't have to. Yeah, it looks like everything's still dead, so I think we'll be, I think we'll be okay. As long as the Pikmin keep pushing. Pri Tony, your last... Your last moment of glory. They they knew that Brittany was the most useful and the most important of the three because they made her the one who has to bring Olimar back to the base. Where's the Wraith even? Oh, he's like all the way over here. Oh yeah, we're fine. Okay, we, we got this. <laughs> oh no. What have you done? Jeez. Yeah, they're taking a very long time. Okay. Where the heck? Oh, there they are. <laughs> okay. Yeah, hindsight was very poor in this sense. I really should have just... <laughs> I should have brought more Pikmin to help with the gate, but it's okay. As long as he doesn't catch up by the time the gate's down. It's not her talking, it's her, like, it's her soul that's talking from beyond the grave. Olimar is definitely not in trouble. Hello, shut up, he's right there, he's fine, relax. Eww. This was not smart at all, I should have had more Pikmin. Okay, well, at the very least, I have them here now, so we can have them help. Add ten more leaves. <laughs> you clearly don't understand. None of you understand. 
We have to transport all of our yes, but not oh my oh the rate is right there. Okay, the rate is right there quickly. Let's go. Go 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 go. He's right there. Quickly, quickly, quickly. <laughs> what are you people doing? Thank you. Oh my god. They got stuck on the invisible gate. What? Alright. Y'all better keep the heck up. Come on. Because we just got to the end. <laughs> We got this. There we go. There we go. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. Except, no, we didn't. <laughs> oh, my Pikmin were still inside of him. Oh, well, they're dead now. Whoops, and there goes Olimar. <laughs> it's like... God, he walks weird and is ugly. Uh is horrifying. Quickly, run away. <laughs> run away, run away, run away. Alright. Okay, so now that we have access to the final, the final phase of the boss fight, I'm ending the day now. And we will spend, hopefully, only one more day fighting this boss. We got this. It is the final day. Now is our chance. We gonna do this. It does look a bit like a cooked chicken, actually. It's a it's a little little offsetting. Off putting? That's the right word. Alright. Didn't even lose any penguin. Awesome. Alright, we got this. I am mentally prepared. I am I am giving myself a pep talk. It's some sort of humanoid. It's going to take everything we've got, but we'll take that thing down. And then we'll save Kapai, and then we'll be heroes. Let's do this. Let's do this. Go team! My earbuds just fell out. What the heck? They didn't feel like being a part of that whole team thing. Alright. This is about to be a momentous occasion that will be in every montage that Philip makes will be the moment that I conquer this boss. Like how the pros do it. Let's go. Alright. So, I was debating trying something different from what I saw people do, but I think I'm going to just stick with what I know. I was watching a dude do a no-death run, so he clearly knows what he's doing. Okay. Alright, so let's do that. Alf, you will lead the rocks. Okay. And uh, Brittany and Charlie take everybody else. Okay. Okay. Well, never mind, that didn't work out. God dang it, seriously. Quickly, come back here. Okay, new plan. Everybody that isn't Brittany, everybody that isn't all, uh, Alf, stay up here. And if I need you, I'll call you. Alright, let's do this. Time has come. Alright, punk, let's do this. So basically, this guy's gonna, like, we attack him and then he poops out, like, little, little gelatin blobs. And basically... If they attack the blobs, he can't regen, and Rock Pikmin are immune to his attacks. So... 
He does have some other, like, elemental attacks. Which means that we can't get him at every opening because I'm only using Rock Pigmen, but that's okay. Because I don't need to get him at every opening. Because, yeah. It just means the fight's gonna take a wee bit longer. But, like, that's whatever. I am more than okay with this. Yeah, and basically it just comes down to I have the pigments spread out and kind of do their own thing and then they'll they'll run around and attack the little blobs on their own. And I don't think he can... Yeah, he can't even eat them either. So, like, literally he can't hurt them. He can't hurt the rock pigment. So, this is perfect. In, like, every regard. There we go. Come on. Come now, kids. Hey, Vangs, what's up? Uh, I didn't actually read your comment. I just saw that you were here and said hello. Give me one second. <laughs> Everything changed when the plasma nice. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Fight. Fight, kids. Fight. Like spy kids. <laughs> okay, quick, quick, quick. Nope, 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 nope. So much nope. So much nope. Oh, no, wait. I can do that. This is the rock one. Awesome. Okay. Alright, you guys got this. Jump them. Jump them. Sick them. Sick them. Good work, guys. Good work. Ooh, just a. Oh, wait. Nope. That's what he does right when the core happens. Okay, so that one's the water one. I can't do that. Get him, get him, get him. See, normally if I'm using, like, all the Pikmin types, I can throw the proper Pikmin type at the core then in order to do damage to it, which really will hurt it quite a bit. But, again, I'm playing it safe and just using Rock Pikmin, so... The only reason I don't, I'm not using entirely Rock Pikmin is if I need backup. But, honestly, there's a decent chance I may just go and get... You know what? I think I will. Honestly, this is the thing that I was worried about. I really hope I don't need the rest of these guys, but I'm just going to grab 40 more Rock Pikmin and I'm going to have them jump into the fight. Okay. So y'all come down here. Alright. Oh, okay. Yeah, the I'm not terribly worried about them, like, being hurt or anything. Oh my god, nope. Oh, there's two cores now. Okay. I understand why I might have wanted backup now. Jump it, jump it, jump it. Alright, so that... Okay, I understand now. Now I know why I would want backup, but I don't care. See these rock pigment on that fight. <laughs> you, lo you lost 91 pigment? Yeah, the only reason I'm doing this is because I did research ahead of time. So, like, I, I know that I need, I know that Rock Pikmin are, like, the intelligent way to do this, but I did not know that the first time I tried this. I also, well, I wouldn't have known that coming into this, and I would have just lost a crap ton of Pikmin, but having done my research prior to now, I've been educated on the most effective way to do this fight, which is super helpful, so... Yeah, and I mean, if that's all he does, he just pokes me and throws me a little bit, but the Rock Pikmin don't take damage. And then, like, if he flies, and you can throw Wing Pikmin at him, and he'll come down or whatever, but it's, it's really, again, not a big deal. We have more than half the day left, and he's lost more than half his health. So, things are going pretty well at the moment. Okay. But then again, once a core comes, I need to grab everyone and start running. Also, Brittany's just all the way on the other side of the map. Come back here. I still want your help, Brittany. There we go. Alright. This is going well. <laughs> there we go. Okay. So he's probably gonna hack up another core.
Okay, where's Carly? There you are. Oh, there's one all the way up there. Wow, okay. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, and I love how his most basic attack just straight up can't hurt, uh... Can't hurt him, so... Okay, I'm actually gonna have... Brittany take control instead. Because Olimar is taking a lot of damage. And if Olimar dies, we got trouble. Actually, here's an idea. I'm gonna have... That's not Olimar. Olimar? Olimar. Olimar, you get out of there, actually. Because I don't need you dying, because that's gonna end the game. I call them Olimar, it's Alf. <laughs> okay, so yeah. Alf, stay there. Because I don't need you dying. The last thing I want is for me to lose this fight because I had one of the captains die. Instead of it just being a massive Pikmin wipeout. Also, he he's not doing the, the standard splart now. Okay. Okay. One of these better be a crystal. Okay, good. It is. Alright, we're going to lose some Pikmin now. That's okay. That is okay. Jump it, jump it, jump it, jump it. Alright. This is fine. Only lost four? Nice. Okay. Oh, he flung me back into the data pad. Alright. Okay. So yeah, big concern is actually making sure that none of the none of the captains die. Yeah, Olimar is the one I'm saving. I Olimar and Alpha have similar names. <laughs> sort of. Where's Charlie? There he is. Okay, Charlie's also not exactly loving life right now. Okay. This'll be fine. We're okay. No, why did you dismiss? There, get him. Well, that went well. God dang it, it does a he does a decent amount of damage actually. Okay. And uh, there's there's no way to to heal. So basically, I just need to keep... I need to play super defensive, basically. Oh, cores, cores, cores are coming, cores are coming. Please, can one of these be a crystal? One of these be a crystal? No, I can't. Oh, one of them is. Alright, again, I don't care that they're being set on fire, I don't care, I don't care, I'm still doing damage. Charlie's in trouble, awesome. Okay, quickly. Oh, it's all water, it's all water, it's all water. <laughs> Okay, and I mean, it still uh, leaves a little bit of stuff behind, like, when it's sucking the cores in anyway. So, it's not like we're completely helpless. Ooh, there's, there's a crystal right over there. Okay. As for if I can get to it, that has yet to be seen. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, don't just drop them. He has so little health left. Holy cow. We can do this. There's another crystal, another crystal. Guys, stop drowning, please. The crystal's on the other side. I can't get to it. They're so low on health. No, 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 no. Okay, I wonder what happens if I... Uh, don't actually beat this fight. Huh. Like, by the end of the day. Oh, that's perfect. This is perfect. This is perfect. This is perfect. This is perfect. Okay, please. Please, please, please. 
This is doable. This is totally doable. Oh my god, we can do this. 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 He's gonna run out of cores events. Oh my god, come on. Come here. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We just take the rock ones. Can't keep doing this forever. Okay, come on. Alright. Alright, we can totally do this. He's only hacking up one core at a time now. Oh, he ran in there. Okay. Get him. Oh, 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 yes! 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 Ha <laughs> ha! Woo! Oh my god, that's awesome. That's awesome. Alright, I guess now we probably need to carry all of them back. Oh, that's awesome. No, alright, we're done. Wow, okay, we did it. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> wow. Alright. Yeah, no, he, he took all the food, bro. Actually, yeah, that's exactly what he did. Piece of treasure. Oh, hey, look. It's our cosmic drive key. What a relief. Pretty Tony. This must be fate, Captain Olimar. Hagatate is on our way home. Is it? So why don't we give you a lift? Olimar has a really deep voice, I'd like to add. Like, his voice is deeper than Charlie's. Oh my god, Louis. Louis such a punk. Way to be, Louis. <laughs> He's like such an idiot. Oh yeah, the 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 onion doesn't come with us. What the? Oh, the 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 wraith is still alive. What the heck? <laughs> yeah, no, sadly, we took Louis with us. <laughs> Farewell, my comrades. Well. There we are. <laughs> no, they're gonna go extinct and die, probably. Cosmic speed, it's one step below ludicrous speed. And so, the intrepid explorers successfully complete their mission. And so the intrepid explorers successfully After securing a bountiful supply of edible matter and learning the valuable lessons of planning and teamwork, the explorers are set to become the saviors of their home planets. Under their guidance, the seeds they've recovered will be used to kick off a sustainable cycle of cultivation and harvesting, thus bringing new life to Kapai. However, one question remains. What was the cause of the accident that sent the SS Drake hurtling to Punt 404 surface? Perhaps it wasn't an accident at all. Louis shot the ship down. Oh, Hannah, you missed the final boss fight. Oh, what a shame. Wasn't terribly exciting, but it was. I was. I was very pleased. And yes, we lost like over 500 Pikmin, so I think we need a total of like somewhere around 532 bads or something. I think it'll give me like a total count at the very end. Oh well, here's the credits. 
Ah. Uh. Well, so, oh my god, this has been this has been a lot of fun for me. I really enjoyed going back and playing through this game and actually getting to beat it for the first time. I hope you all enjoyed the experience with me. I know a lot of you haven't really experienced Pikmin before. Those of you in the chat, not necessarily referring to the YouTube, <laughs> but this has been a lot of fun for me. I hope you guys enjoy this. I know Drew says he's interested. <laughs> So hey, all sorts of all sorts of fun stuff. This was a this was yeah the second playthrough. Uh, this is definitely much more quieter and tamer than Galaxy, but still still a good ride. But yeah, starting next week we're gonna be doing uh, Banjo Kazooie on w Wednesdays, so that's gonna be some really fun to look forward to. That's a, another fantastic game. But uh, yeah, I guess. Um, I don't know if there's anything that happens after the credits, but, I mean, this is some, this is some really nice looking credits, so. What the- Oh! <laughs> Stupid anteater. Way to ruin it. The voice. There was one person who did the voice for every character. <laughs> I guess. What? Huh. Interesting. Oh! <laughs> he dead. <laughs> this is such a great looking game. Oh my god. I love this game so much. Actually, yeah, playing through Pikmin 3 again has made me want to uh, revisit some of the older Pikmin games. So, like, um, Pikmin 1 and Pikmin 2 are definitely not uh, out of the possibility. So, I don't know when I would get around to doing those, but I think they'd be a lot of fun. So, especially Pikmin 2. I've never played Pikmin 2, actually, so that would be, like, fantastic to play. But we shall see. Now this game was made in 2013. This is a four-year-old game. Wow. Time flies. Oh, also the Pikmin singing in the credits. It's awesome. <laughs> Aw. <sighs> and what it ended is... Game 100%ed, final boss successfully beaten with minimal casu casualties during the fight, not necessarily outside of the fight. We, we need to give salutes to all 500 plus Pikmin who were sacrificed for my betterment and my continued existence. Final report, here we are. So yeah, all 66 fruit, that's pretty awesome. This took 17 hours and 25 minutes. We had 667 Pikmin at the very end of the game, and we lost 491 throughout the course of the game. We lost the most blue Pikmin, probably because that's the the group of Pikmin I was using during that uh, that spider boss fight that just destroyed me. Also, apparently, there's like rankings in, a, in like a top five. I'm curious to see what the top five is. Oh, this is- oh, this is my best five. Oh, so if I play the game again, it'll keep- oh, okay. Well, then show me here. I guess this is the average? This is- oh, yeah, global. This is what most people do. So most people beat the game around 40. Okay. And I took 37 days. Most days needed to take home all the fruit. There are some people who took 99. And there's some people who took 10. Those minimal day runs. Apparently, though, I'm, like, slightly better than average, so that's actually kind of awesome. And good to know, and reassuring. <laughs> nice. Hey, Casey, you just missed the very end of Pikmin. <laughs> Sucks, but at least you brought Starbucks. Well, there we go. That was Pikmin 3. Alright.